having an amazing day. This is your coach, uh, Shahid Zaman Khan, and uh, I'm going to teach you today some of very, very technical shots, which is very important for a stroker squash player. So when I say stroker, because in the game, if you're just hitting length and cross, it's not a stroke master or stroke player. So in, in order to make strokes, you have to be aggressive on your strokes and on your kill shots. If you have the kill shots, a good kill shots, you can easily win the points in the game and you can finish the rally more quick. Some of the players are just retrievers, so they just retrieve the ball. And some of them are a stroke players, like Remy Ashur, or you can say a legend, uh, one of my uncles, Mr. Kamar Zaman, who was a magician of shots in 1975, British Open champion. I mean, uh, most of his time, uh, people know that he's the master of strokes. Um, so I'm gonna teach you today some of those shots, which is very effective, on returning of the serves you can return on straight drive or you can return with a volley good drop shot so let me teach you some some of the very good shots, to shots uh, if you want to use those kill shots make sure because most of the people want to hit the kill shot but they are not ready for it what is what it means of ready I mean if you are not on your toes you're not ready if you are standing on full feet it means that you're not ready. So you have to be on your toes. If you're on your toes, it means you're more ready and you will be able to attack. Attack so you can take the ball first time like a punch, like a punch volley. So if you're taking those shots early, you will attack on your opponent. When you're attacking, your opponent is gonna be always in trouble. So I'm gonna teach you if, let's see, so if you can take me from that side, I'll teach you that, uh, or go a little bit more back. So I'll teach you what's the advantage of hitting a tight straight drive, which is called hard and low. If you're using that hard and low, the ball can come very fast in the back, behind the red box, bounce and die in the back. It's not that you're hitting the ball too hard, which will pop up again from the back wall. It's very easy for your opponent. So when you're hitting that hard and low, you need to have that position early to hit the ball. So when you're hitting the ball early, the ball can go back and die in the back. So it's very important that you can attack on the surface. Because if you're just retrieving the ball, it's not attack. So I hope you guys enjoy and learning on these skill shots. Uh, in future, I'll teach you more of these.